today. Quite excited today. This is the first time I'm gonna do boning ribeye tomahawk dry aging. This came from um, Sam's Club. Uh, this is choice. And at the same time, I'm gonna do prime. This one has really nice marbling ribeye. Um, that one was about 14 bucks a pound. And this one was about eight bucks a pound. Sometimes I find them at Costco cheaper, but this one has really nice marbling. And uh, this one, it's hard to find sometimes. So I'm excited. I wanna see what they look like inside. And then probably gonna do about 40 day dry aging. Alright, times to put time to put this one in. Ugh. Okay, second piece going in. Let's hope it fits. So there we go. Boning Tomahawk Rebuy, Prime Rebuy. New York Street Prime, and that's the 100 day rebuy. And this one was choice. All right, 40 days. Let's see how it goes. Hey, everybody. So it's been 42 days, and this guy is looking really nice. Um, no mold. Interestingly enough, I've never had mold with this refrigerator so um, we're gonna start processing it see how uh, hard it is I'm guessing it's gonna be uh, the most hard down here but let's see I want to try and go between the bones this knife is awesome by the way I like this one better than the butchering one just because it's longer. And then this one for the end here. Just one little piece there. Even better. All right, this is the steak for tonight. All right, so as you can see, uh, change of clothes, and I'm actually a few days later, um, finish uh, cutting the, the rest of the meat. And now I'm gonna cook this for dinner tonight. But uh, part of that change of uh, clothes is, you know how they say cut away from you? Well, the knife that you saw I was using previously, the, the big one, it's Shan knife. I, I love those knives. They're very sharp. And uh, as I was cutting around some of these bones, I was cutting actually towards me and um, they, it, it goes through very fast. So as I was holding the meat like this, went through on another piece and ended up with uh, five stitches on that day. So uh, I had to postpone finishing the video. So uh, yeah, never cut towards yourself, always cut away from yourself. Um, and and um, knife like that, you know, you went, went in very quick so luckily it wasn't anything serious but uh did delay me from finishing the video so that's why i still have the the hand covered here at the very beginning of the video i also had a, a prime that was boneless from that i created some beef tallow tastes really good um that that meat came amazing 
I stopped it at about uh, 37 days and then um, with that fat I made the beef tallow. Um, my wife helped me and uh, we got two jars out of that one rack so that was amazing. So I'm going to use that beef when I see it on the cast iron. Um, I'm, I'm going to use that tallow when I do that but for now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a little bit of uh, avocado oil and just salt, garlic and uh, garlic powder and, and black pepper um, and I'm going to leave the meat like this in the refrigerator for like a couple of hours then I'm going to do I'm going to grill it um, outside first and then we're going to do a cast iron um, at the very end okay so I have the meat ready it's outside I have the grill ready first uh, I'm gonna smoke it I'm gonna put some uh, hickory chips on there okay so the steak is ready uh, for searing I have my um, cast iron plate there and I did put in a bit of the tallow, you know, just a little bit of oil. Try and get as much contact as possible. And uh, I'm going to put a bit of tallow on top of it as well. That's a nice cross layer developing. It doesn't take very long. I'm holding it about 30 seconds. All right, so the meat has rested for about 10 minutes or so. Um, I'm gonna cut it from the bone. See what it looks like. I'm slightly concerned that it might be overdone. The thermometer um, didn't work that great. But let's cut it and see what it looks like. Yeah, it's not that bad, but I would rather have it less done. And we're going to cut a piece. That's the hole where the thermometer was. My son Logan is going to tell us if it tastes any good or not. And if he can taste the dry age. Is it good? You mm -hmm. like it? All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. He stole my bone. Must be good. <laughs> <laughs>